What's going on, guys? Today, I'm bringing you guys the ultimate game of head, shoulders, knees, and toes, bone breaking edition. And this is extremely cool. It's going to combine all the different transitions that I've had on my channel, along with a couple bone breaks added on. And it's honestly, it's super cool. But in order to do this, you're going to need to know how to do a, lo a list of bone breaks, including uh, the jump rope, the dead arm, uh, the chicken wing, advanced chicken wing, human lace, and reverse jump rope. You're going to need to know how to do all of those, and you're going to need to know how to do the basic transitions that I've actually taught on this channel, like I mentioned a second ago. So I'll have links to all those videos uh, in the um, video description, so definitely check those out. Definitely stretch before doing this. You don't want to get injured. And anyways, guys, let's get started on this insane transition. So the reason this is called head, shoulders, knees, and toes is because you're going to start from your head pretty much and work your way all the way to your toes and then back up uh, doing different bone breaks as you go. So it's extremely cool. And anyways, guys, let's get started on how to actually learn it. Alright guys, so to start this, you're going to start by doing a jump rope. Now, if you've seen my transitions, this is going to be the jump rope to the dead arm. And so pretty much what you're going to do is first, as always, start with whatever side you feel more comfortable with. So for this, I'm going to be doing this whole combo mostly with my right side of my body. If you do it with your left and you've seen all my videos, you already know how to do it with the left. So just start with your left. So, okay. So, like I said, do the jump rope, or at least the dislocation for the jump rope. Bend and get to your dead arm. From here, you're going to lift over your head, like always, and this is going to be the transition from the dead arm to the chicken wing. So over into the chicken wing, like this. Next, from the chicken wing, you're going to transition from, the, like I said, the chicken wing, to the advanced chicken wing, which this is as something I haven't actually taught on this channel because it's super simple and honestly it doesn't need a tutorial to actually learn how to do this. So from the chicken wing, all you're going to do is slide your hands down and then from here you're just twisting like this. So one more time, you're going to be in the chicken wing, you're going to slide your hands down, then you're just going to simply twist and now you're in the advanced chicken wing. So now you're in the advanced chicken wing. What you're going to do now is transition to the human lace. So all you have to do, if you've seen that tutorial, is slip one of your arms under your leg like this, grab it, pull through like so, and you're here. Now from here, you're going to release your grip and grab behind you. So again, from here, just go and get into your grip that you would do for the reverse jump rope. Just a side note here, after you do the human lace and it's, it, your grip is still in front of you, you're going to basically go from a crouching position and stand up. And at that time, that's when you're going to go and switch your grip. So from behind, since I'm switching to the reverse jump rope, I'm going and I'm going like this. And from here, I'm just going to straight up do the advanced jump rope. So from the front, again, I'm here. Well, I stand up, I'm here. Switch grips, reverse jump rope. Then from here, since I was doing this with my right, I can either, if you're very advanced, you can go and do the whole head to shoulders on your other side of your body, or you could just switch your grip, start from the beginning, go again and do it at your own pace, whatever. Uh, the faster you do this, the cooler it actually will look, but don't do it too quickly to the point where you're going to end up hurting yourself. But yeah, anyways, guys, this is the advanced transition, the head, to sh head, shoulders, knees, and toes. And yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. So yeah, if you guys did enjoy this series of transitions, please give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and hit the bell to get notified anytime I put a new video out. Share it with your friends. Maybe they want to learn a really, really awesome, unique transition that I'm pretty sure no one's ever done on YouTube. I've never seen anyone do it, and I... Pretty sure I came up with this kind of myself, even though I didn't come up with the specific transitions necessarily. But anyways, guys, 
I'll see you in the next video.